All right, today we have got the Dean Gordon Virtus, I believe that's how that's pronounced. Virtus, Virtus, Virtios. Uh, okay, shut up, here we go. We have got a maple neck with 24 frets and this really awesome, super unique fret access. As you can see, my big fat hand versus this guitar. Uh, I normally am not really able to access the upper fret, but with this cutaway here and this very cool knee support, I can get all up in them top frets, which is very cool. We've got DiMarzio ionizers. We've got a hip shot bridge, three-way selector, volume, tone. Love this. A very easily accessible truss rod adjustment. I don't know why so many people have to hide their truss rod adjustments, like they're afraid somebody's gonna realize their guitar has a truss rod or something, but this is a wonderful thing. Thank you, Dean, you wonderful boy. Moving our way up the neck, we've got this nice minimal little Dean Gordon logo. Love that. Uh, we've got a little string stay and this cute little maneuver right here, you can see the serial number has been milled in, which I think is just, it's such a nice touch. It's its simple, but man, it looks so nice. So let's flip them over, huh? As you can see, this maple neck is bolted on to this alder body. We've got Spurzel, the OG locking tuners. And I also very much appreciate we're using a normal input jack versus a barrel plug, which is very nice to see because the barrel plugs seem to fail always. That is the Dean Gordon Virtus six string. Let's get some fun little angles there for you. Wow, wow, wow. Probably out of focus, gotta love that, wow. And without further ado, Let's play some music.
So a little bit more information about Dean Gordon. Dean Gordon, as far as I know, is based out of New York, has about four to five employees, so it's a very small custom shop. And they're building some very unique guitars. My recommendation for application on this guitar would be sort of a like a studio king. This is your, your solo monster that you whip out if you know you're gonna be doing some crazy high stuff, whipping out some Mohammed Suismez bends on the 24th. I think this is a very cool, very unique build. I really, really, really love the upper fret access and the little metal wing feels very, very comfortable, surprisingly comfortable. And the whole thing just kind of feels right. It fits in your lap right, it fits in your hands right. The neck is not particularly thick, but it does have a little bit of chunk to it, but I actually appreciate the chunk in this case. Normally I'm a little annoyed by thicker necks. This is sort of, I would say, something like a Fender Strat kind of feeling neck. I love the use of the locking tuners, especially that cute little teal going with the blue over here. Very nicely put together, I say. Nicely done, Dean Gordon. Now, obviously, this is pretty far outside my wheelhouse. I generally play the first four frets on an eight string tune to drop Z. So this is not quite what I would normally be going for, but I still really appreciate this guitar and I could definitely see adding one of these to my arsenal. If you're interested in Dean Gordon guitars, you can check them out on Instagram at Dean Gordon Guitars, or check out their website, which is behind me right now, deangordonguitars.com. If you like this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more videos like this, touch the subscribe button. If you actually want to see more videos, ring that bell, because as we all know, subscribing does nothing now in 2020. What do you think? of this guitar. Would you play something like this? Or what's the weirdest guitar that you've played? Leave me a comment below. Let's talk about it. If you like what I'm doing here, you can support me on Patreon. It helps keep this light, this light, this light, this light, that monitor and all the stuff behind me turned on and keeps food in my belly so that I don't die. That was a little excessive, but I'm gonna stick with it. Uh, you can support me on Patreon. It's patreon.com slash drusif. If you jump in on the Patreon thing, you can get stems like from this video. You can get behind the scenes looks at videos. You can get extra long tutorials on color grading and mixing. You can see videos a day early and you get access to a super secret Discord. Thanks so much for watching. Go compliment your best friend, and I will see you the next time that I do a video. You can follow me on Instagram at It's Drusive, Twitter at It's Drusive, TikTok at It's Drusive, uh, What's that other one, the Vine 2, that just, whatever that is, at It's Drusif. It's all at It's Drusif. I'm all over the internet and I'm coming for you. I will be in your brain and your eyes no matter what. It'll be me there going, 